Hey, hello guys, I'm Richard Sanaji and it feels awesome to have you here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create bootable ISO files for Windows 10, Windows 11 or be it any kind of window. But before we go into doing that, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, I'd like you to subscribe right now. So whenever I make awesome videos like this, you'll be the first to watch and take action or be the solution provider, right? So now that you've done doing that, come on, let's go make some bootable so ISO files. Okay guys, so to create an ISO file is pretty easy, right? So, um, you open the document that contains um, your windows your windows file so here in this case that's mine so you just copy all the files then you right click and you see power eyes right so you click here you see you see click on add file so it's as easy as that So here, so the type right. Uh, so here is you put standard ISO. So basically that's what we want here. Then um, then click OK. Then why we allow? So guys, so um, this the ISO file we just created, right? So let's go back. So this is the ISO file here. So um, let's copy it and uh, to our desktop. So we'll copy it. So we'll paste it on our desktop. So we'll paste it here. So guys, uh, that's how to create your ISO file. So it's pretty easy. So to make it bootable, uh, it's to make it so here, it's pretty easy. So this is Windows 10. So we can just rename it as uh, Windows 10. Let's rename it. So here, Windows 10. Windows 10. So here. So these are uh, Windows 10 uh, ISO file guys. So guys, so that's how to create ISO file for your Windows 10. So this uh, process apply to both Windows 10, Windows 11, Windows 8 as a case may be. So guys, enjoy. So um, in next video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a bootable USB drive with this ISO, ISO file that we created, right? Cheers.